guys um, welcome back to my channel I know you guys have missed me I haven't made a video in so long that as you can see I have a new background my whole apartment was painted um, at the beginning of the year so it was kind of like really crazy um, putting everything in the middle of the apartment and painting and putting everything back we're still in the process of still putting things back so I do have a new background my background isn't as bare I have pictures but they I moved it a little bit so you can't even see it but Whatever. This video is not about my background. Um, this video is about me updating you guys on the hair that I purchased, the hair by Belle Brie. But before I even go into the review, I just want to give a huge shout out to Taryn. Taryn um, recently made a, a three-fourth wig and she shouted me out in the video and I didn't know about it as of yet, but I remember waking up and um, syncing my phone so my emails can come in and I had like 50 plus emails from um, YouTube saying that I had new subscribers and I'm like what the hell what happened overnight and one of the comments was um, Taryn um, talked about you in the video so I'm checking you out and I'm like oh my gosh she did so I checked the video and lo and behold Taryn shouted me out when she made her three fourth wig um, which is a shock to me and I just really 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 want to thank Taryn for um, for doing that lovely gesture my homie <laughs> for doing that uh, that lovely gesture and sending you guys my way so um, over the past few days since Friday I think I've had over a thousand subscribers so I just want to welcome you all and the ones that are just keep coming just keep coming I hope you guys enjoy my channel um, let me just keep this video short I'm updating you guys on my hair by Belle Brie I purchased this hair about a month maybe a little bit more um, than that I don't remember the day that I got the hair but um, actually, you know what? I purchased it in November on Black Friday. So um, my review on the hair. The pros and the cons. First of all, I would like to give it a 7.5 out of 10. Um, that's how I would rate the hair. Um, as far as rating the company and their professionalism, I'll give them a 10 out of 10 because they are truly, 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 truly professional. Now on to the pros and the cons. I will start with the good. <laughs> so the pros about the hair is that the hair is very true to length. When I purchased this hair, I purchased an 18, 20, and 22 inch, and the hair is really, really long. Like, I really, really like the length on the hair. Um, another pro about the hair is that it does hold color. I colored the hair black initially because I rinsed my hair black. It's just easier to blend with my hair. And then for New Year's Eve, um, while everyone was bringing the new year in I was bringing new color in so I ombre um, the end of the hair I don't know if you guys can see but I put a little bit of red so the hair has red tips so I ombre the hair um, I did highlight some parts here but it's not really showing up but whatever so um, and it's really nice and thick so the three bundles that I purchased um, was good enough to do the full head, the 18, 20, and 22. You guys know that the longer the length, the less the hair, but um, I got more for my money. Um, the, the Another pro, I'm about to go into the cons, but another pro is that it holds a curl really, really well. Um, what I would do at night is I would flex you rod the hair, spray a little bit of water in it, flex you rod the hair, and wake up in the morning, and those curls will last me all day. Um, if I don't feel like flexi riding my hair, I can pin curl my hair at night and it will do the same exact thing. It will definitely hold the curl really, really well. So that's a definite pro that it holds the curls. These curls that I have in my hair were due to flexi rods. Um, and side note, the reason why I have this hat on is because I haven't been wearing this wig for the past week. Um, I took the wig off on last week Monday because I just really got tired of the hair. And I recently I've been rocking my kinky curly. I love this one. So this is what I've been rocking recently. And before recording this video, I actually washed my hair, um, deep conditioned it, and rebraided my hair. So my hair is actually braided. All of my head is braided for the kinky curly wig, especially for the leave out. Whatever. So that's why I have the, the hat on. But I'm like, why do a review on Belle by Brie here and not have the hair in my head? So on to the cons about the hair. A huge, 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 huge con. There are two cons about this hair. One is it sheds. It sheds like a dog. Maybe worse than a dog. Like somebody who is losing their hair shedding. It's really, really bad. Um, and I sealed the wefts. So I sealed the wefts and the hair still sheds. So that sucks. I have hair everywhere. Every time I do my hair, there's hair everywhere. When I go in the bathroom and I finger comb my hair, I have a 
huge hump of hair in my head, um, in my hand. But the thing is, is that it still didn't lose its thickness, but I was just shedding like crazy. Um, another huge con is that the hair mats, like, really, really bad. Like, cheap hair mats. And um, it's kind of disappointing because I did purchase this hair with my own money. I paid about $270, I think, for the hair. Um, so it's not like I bought cheap beauty supply, $19.99 hair. Um, I spent a good almost $300 on the hair, and for the hair to mat up really bad um, is quite disappointing and was very frustrating. I did contact the company to let them know about the, the matting and the shedding and she was just totally nice. I wasn't rude to her and I wasn't really nasty with her because that's just not my personality. But I just wanted to inform her that I wasn't really satisfied with the batch that I received um, and I tried everything she told me to do. I tried using the Moroccan oil in my hair um, as some people on YouTube have reviewed and said they've used this in their hair. I tried using the coconut, um, the Palmer's coconut, whatever, conditioner, I put this in my hair. Um, I even saw someone on YouTube who said they've put um, silicone mix in their hair and it helped with the matting, um, but it worked for me. Like I, tr I tried everything that they wanted me to do. I soaked the hair with it, I put it in the microwave for 30 seconds, I let it sit in a towel. I let it sit in the towel for about two hours so it's nice and deep conditioned. I limited my heat with it. Like I told you guys, I was using flexi rods in the hair. The hair still matted. And um, what the company informed me was that it is, you know, virgin hair and it's taken off a donor so you need to add moisture to it. But I've been doing that and the hair still mat. So I found one solution to help with um, the matting and that was I put a stronger um, moisturizer in my hair. So I was using my olive oil my olive oil moisturizer um, in, in the hair and that helped but the only thing is it kind of weighed it down a little bit because it's a heavier moisturizer so it made the hair like extra like silky and I really wasn't a huge fan of it but whatever. Um, the company on the other hand she was very very nice and she was patient with me and she worked with me to try to make sure that I was happy with the hair. Unfortunately, I didn't get a good batch, so um, I wasn't really happy with the hair, but I'm not dis um, saying that this company is bad, because I've seen other reviews where people um, like the hair. Um, and she did send me another batch of 22 inch for free, which was really, really nice of her. She said she doesn't really do that, but because I was really nice with her, um, she was going to try to work with me. Um, so shout out to her for just being just so... Um, so warm and welcome and just being so nice and she represented her company very well so as far as the company is concerned and how she um runs her company i would give it 10 stars out of 10 stars like she was just the best person she helped me out but unfortunately i had a bad batch of hair um i did contact another youtuber um who is reviewing the hair and i asked her if she was having the same problems and she did tell me that she is having the same problems but she was informed that um Brie is going to be um, getting a new vendor because a lot of people have been complaining. So maybe down the line I will um, repurchase from her because I really respect the way that this woman um, runs her company and um, I, I just respect people that's like that. So maybe down the line she will get my money again for me to buy a new batch of hair to review for you guys. But for now um, I'm rocking my Mongolian kinky curly wig uh, that I love to death and um, actually I do have a hair coming in. I purchased some hair um, again from um, one of my vendors from AliExpress, and um, right now it's their Chinese New Year, so I'm going to be getting my hair at the end, at the beginning of February. So when I get that hair, and um, I know one of my new subscribers asked me to do a step by step and verbally explain how I make a three fourth wig, so I will do that, and I will also cut and style my hair in that video. Hopefully, the video is like 10 minutes because you know I hate long videos. Um, that's about it. Um, if you guys have any, any more questions about the hair, um, you can hit me up down in the description box below or you can inbox me. Um, I wanted my video to be um, honest with you guys. I don't want to bash a company, but I also want to be very, very truthful in how I review stuff because I don't want to deceive my subscribers because I bought this hair from looking at a review from another YouTuber. So when I saw how lovely the hair looked every time she made a video, I was like, why not go and buy it? But I, I feel like sometimes you don't get the real review because they're sent the hair for free. But since I purchased this hair out of my own pocket, I might as well give you guys
guys a real review and I will continue to give you guys a real review because I don't want to deceive any of my subscribers. If you guys want to know the best Brazilian wavy hair to get and it's very inexpensive, go on AliExpress. Um, I would suggest you doing research on vendors and hairs and companies. Um, I have no problem doing reviews on my own and buying hair from bad companies because I can help you guys out so you guys won't make the same mistake. I mean, what's the point of having my new YouTube channel without doing reviews on hair? So um, I will be getting more hair from AliExpress and I will do a review on it. I already know the hair is going to be the bomb anyway. Um, I bought more hair from them. I bought two bundles of 22, 18, and 16. Can't wait till it comes in. Um, and that's about it. If you guys want me to do a review on a company, just let me know what company you want. Hopefully they're not expensive. If they're like a cheap company and the hair is really cheap, I will go and buy the hair and I will review it for you. That's about it, guys. I'm sorry the video is kind of long, but it is a review and um, I have to blabber a little bit. I'm trying to give you guys all the information you possibly can. Hopefully you didn't skip through the video. <laughs> and um, I know I'm going to get a lot of questions about this, what I have on my lips. I have on um, Revlon, and the color is Moon. No, the color is Orange Flip, and it's 710. I would zoom in, but my camera doesn't zoom in. So it's this Revlon lipstick that I have, and the color is Orange Flip, number 710. I'll put it in the description box below. Um, on my nails, because a lot of people ask what I have on my nails. So on my nails, I have the Sally Hansen Salon Effects. I don't remember the style of it. I know the box is in my um, garbage right now, so I'll just put that in the description box below. The necklace that I have on, I purchased from Charlotte Ruse, and the sweater that I have on, it's from H&M. And the earrings that I have on is a gift from my boo, um, from Kate Jewelers. is a gold and white gold hoop, so that's about it, guys. You enjoy the rest of your week, and I will try to make more videos for you.